The Greek story of Arachne is one of the most fascinating tales of ancient times. It's a story of pride, competition, and the consequences of arrogance. It's one of my favorite Greek myths. In fact, I named my production company Arachne Productions after this story. And it's also where the word arachnid originally comes from. Arachne was a young girl who lived in Lydia, a kingdom in ancient Greece. She was a talented weaver and was known for her skill in creating beautiful and intricate designs. People came from far and wide to see her work and admire her talent. But Arachne's pride and arrogance soon got the better of her. She challenged the goddess of wisdom and weaving, named Athena, to a weaving contest. Arachne was confident that her skills were superior to those of the goddess and that she would be able to defeat her. Athena accepted the challenge and the two began their weaving competition. Arachne's work was truly beautiful, but it was also filled with images of gods and goddesses doing very immoral things. Athena, on the other hand, created a masterpiece depicting scenes from Greek mythology and the wisdom of the gods. When the contest was over, it was clear that Athena had won. But Arachne was not content with losing. She continued to boast and brag about her skills, even going as far as to claim she was a better weaver than the gods. Athena was furious with Arachne's arrogance, and she inflicted her punishment. The color drained from Arachne's face as she felt the beginnings of the Greek goddess's spiteful curse. She began to sprout legs, one after the other. She grew more eyes until she had eight, and eventually Arachne was no longer a beautiful maiden. Athena had turned her into the very first spider. This day, Arachne continues to weave delicate and intricate works of art of a different kind. The story of Arachne and Athena is, of course, where the word arachnid comes from. The story of arachnid serves as a cautionary tale about the dangers of pride and arrogance. It reminds us that we should always be mindful of our actions and words, and that we should strive to show respect to those who are wiser and more skilled than us.
which is why I chose Arachne as the name of my production company. Not only is my goal to create beautiful and intricate works of art, filming and photographing tarantulas and other arachnids, but it's also a reminder of myself to stay humble, always be willing to learn, and to never consider myself the best in this field. You got to avoid buying your own bullcrap. That, my friends, is the story of Arachne, as well as the origin of the word arachnid. As always, I appreciate you watching. Subscribe if you want to see more. Thanks for buying Tarantula Collective merchandise, and I will see you next Tuesday. <laughs>